Hey guys, if you don't have and own this game yet but want to win it, simply like this video and leave a comment down below. Winners will be picked and announced this weekend, so good luck. So having exotics to chase in this game is a great thing. It gives us something to play for besides the usual leveling systems we've come accustomed to. Now I've made a video in which I showcase 15 plus exotics and how to farm them. Those videos can be found linked within the video description. But it seems as though many many people are having problems with said methods of getting exotics. Today I can confirm that there's actually a problem here. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoy your stay here and would like to show your support, hit that like button truly helps out. And if you want to see more Avengers on my behalf, make sure you subscribe. So I have searched the highs and lows of the internet and details of exotics from this Avengers game. And I believe I now know the ins and outs of them. Now as you might know, exotics besides the campaign reward major exotics and the reigning supreme mission chain and the elite heroic high first time completion major artifacts, exotics that are specific to individual Avengers as of right now have only one drop source and that is the elite heroic hives. Which are basically the end game of end games within this game. All the exotics I have researched dropping have dropped from here to players at a 130 power level or above. But at the same time people I have seen countless concerns that there is just something not right about how these work. Many many people think there's a bug as I've seen reports of people getting one exotic for the first time they run this then run it another 20 times and don't get absolutely anything. I've seen people state they've run this elite heroic hive mission and not get a single reward at the end which is just bizarre. I've seen many people speculate that you are limited to one exotic from this elite heroic hive mission and I've seen people even mention that they've had rewards and then just had that loot just vanish. Now Square Enix have put out details on patch notes which you guys can see on screen now. The PC patch went live on the Sith and one is due for consoles too. They do address some of the more popular concerns I have seen being made by the community like campaign mission outfits disappearing and so forth but there was nothing within these notes that mentioned anything to do with the Elite Heroic Hive mission, its rewards or exotics. But while well, people, I can actually confirm, Square Enix have indeed confirmed that there is a problem and it was done by a dev on reddit who said the following. Exotics aren't a guaranteed drop. It's a chance to drop but there's a bug with elite hives not granting rewards appropriately. And they confirmed they are investigating this issue. Now this was a reply to a post of somebody actually talking about exotics and how they seem bugged from the heroic hive missions. So this just confirms it. And that is honestly good to know. And to be honest, I think I can forgive them for there being the odd bug here and there. The game's brand new and to be honest it runs a million times better than what the beta did where people made their mind about this game without actually going into the main game just because of the beta. But the difference between this and the beta are unbelievable. And a few patches in and I do believe performance wise it should be near perfect, especially on consoles. But yeah guys, it's now being confirmed that there was a problem and they are looking into it. And the problem lies with those elite heroic hive missions, which as of right now are the main source for exotic drops for our Avengers. So I thought I'd bring you guys the news if you thought something was up, at least now you know it's confirmed. And on that note guys we have come to the end of the video, if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Avengers be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by, hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.